Let's take a look at how to manually install machine profiles in Simplify 3D for your M3 printer. The first thing we're going to do is go to makergear.zendesk.com where we have all of the knowledge base articles for the MakerGear M3. I'm going to go ahead and click on MakerGear M3 3D printer. And under slicing and printing, you'll see an article that says Simplify 3D profiles and factory files for the M3 and M3 ID. This article is going to stay updated with our latest versions of the profiles. And it's going to be this first link. Click here to download. So this is automatically going to download a zip file for you. Once you've downloaded the zip file, you're going to want to extract it. Once you've extracted the files, you'll see the Maker Gear M3 profiles folder. Inside, you'll see a Simplify 3D folder, as well as an independent dual or single extruder folder. These .fff files contain the machine profiles that we're going to use in Simplify 3D. Make your M3 STL file is a STL file with an image of the bed. In Simplify 3D, we want to add our STL bed. The Mac, it's going to be Simplify 3D Preferences. On Windows, it's going to be Tools Options. We're going to go to Machine, and if you don't have this Make Your Gear M3 STL, just go to Add, navigate to that folder that you just created, Simplify 3D. Um, both the STLs in the independent and the single are identical, so you can use either. In my case, I added a second, so I just want one of them. Now I can go to File import FFF profile. So again, if I was just using the single extruder, I would just have to navigate to that Maker Gear Profiles folder, Simplify 3D, single extruder, find this Maker Gear M3 SE. And I should see this Maker Gear M3 single extruder. Now when I go to add under select profiles, I should see Maker Gear M3 single extruder. If I'm using an independent dual, I'm going to import my FFF profiles, go to independent dual. And as you can see, there are multiple profiles here. So you can select multiple profiles or import them one at a time. In my case, I'll select all four of them and click open. I should see them all listed here. And then when I go to add a process, I should see each individual profile. You click Show Advanced and see all these advanced tabs. You can double check your profiles. We're going to have a list of all of the starting and ending scripts for each profile. If you want to double check to make sure that they've been imported properly, here you can see the M3 single. Here's the M3 independent dual, independent dual with duplication mode, poly support, and PVA. If for some reason you find that the profiles are not importing correctly, you might have a corrupted profile in your list. We'd recommend using the Export FFF profile to export any profiles that are important to you. And then go to Help and Reset All Settings. This is going to reset all of your Simplify 3D settings, and then you should have no problem uploading new profiles.